Hello everyone, welcome back again to U.S. Defense. U.S. approves $380 million finished request for Stinger missiles on heels of Sidewinder and JSO do sales. Before watching, please subscribe to the channel. Finland plans on increasing its Stinger stockpile in order to bolster land and air defense capabilities along Europe's northern flank, supporting the U.S. European Command's top priorities in the process, according to the State Department. The U.S. State Department has cleared Finland to acquire Raytheon FIM-92K Stinger Man, Portable Air Defense System, MA and PADS, weaponry and related equipment, in a potential $380 million deal. Announced on Thursday, the package includes 350 standard Stinger missiles, alongside five separate production verification flight tests, PVFT, versions of the weapon, support equipment, production, engineering, technical services, and logistics support. This proposed sale will support the foreign policy and national security of the United States by improving the security of a trusted partner, which is an important force for political stability and economic progress in Europe, the State Department said in a statement. It is vital to the U.S. national interest to assist Finland in developing and maintaining a strong and ready self-defense capability. Finland plans on increasing its Stinger stockpile in order to bolster land and air defense capabilities along Europe's northern flank supporting the U.S. European Command's top priorities in the process, according to the State Department. Principal contractors of the sale are listed as Raytheon Missiles and Defense, Tuxin, AZ, and Lockheed Martin Corporation, Syracuse, New York. The Stinger sale comes just three days after Washington approved a $323 million foreign military sale for Finland to purchase Raytheon AI M9X Block II Sidewinder missiles and AGM-154 Joint Standoff Weapons, or JSOW. That deal specifically covers 40 of the Block II weapons and 48 JSOW munitions. A total of four tactical guidance units for the Block II system have been requested with supporting items like dummy training missiles, flight program software and spares. That proposed sale, the State Department said, will improve Finland's air-to-air -air and air-to-surface weapons capabilities and will positively impact U.S. relations with countries in the Nordic region. Finland intends to use these defense articles and services for its fighter aircraft fleet. While it has not been made entirely clear which Finnish Air Force fighter fleet will receive the weapons, it would appear they will be equipped on Boeing F-18 Hornets as the U.S. State Department previously approved FMS to Finland for F-35 weapons that included 150 AIM-9X Block II Plus and 100 JSOU C-1 munitions. Under Finland's $11 billion HS procurement program, 64 F-35 of fifth-generation fighter jets are to replace the F-A-18 fleet from 2025 onward. Upon announcing the F-35 selection in December 2021, the Finnish government stated that the F-35 was ranked best against other aircraft during a military capability assessment. Across the Nordic region, the fighter jet is already in service with Denmark and Norway. The new Stinger, Sidewinder and JSO do sales, subject to congressional approval and further negotiations with the companies involved, come as Finland awaits entry to NATO with Scandinavian counterpart Sweden. Prompted to do so after Russia's invasion of Ukraine, NATO accession represents a pivotal security change on behalf of the two nations that have long debated joining the alliance. During a three-day visit to the U.S. this week, Antti Kekkonen, Finland's Minister of Defense, will discuss Russia's war in Ukraine and NATO ascension with General Philip Lavin, Supreme Allied Commander Transformation, at NATO's Joint Operation Headquarters in Norfolk, according to Finland's Ministry of Defense. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. See you on the next video.